Kristen, what's yeah. what's your impression of the Yeah, election? I mean, everybody certainly learned in this country what the notwithstanding clause is, and that was uh, sort of where this all started, this mm -hmm. notion of, um, you know, cutting the size of council. You know, reminding reminding your viewers, we would, we would have potentially had a 47-seat council if um, Premier Ford had not put forward that bill to, to reduce the size. Um, I think that was the most exciting part. No one's talking about that today, are they, Jamie? That's it's right. interesting. It's we've all moved past quick, it. Quick memory. Absolutely. So we've all moved past it. We've all very much accepted that it's going to be a 25-seat council, which I think is far more reasonable. You and I um, spend a lot of time around that yes, chamber, we and we yes, know we that even though sort of the daily operations of government in the municipal level work, right. I mean, the closest level to the people, it's the broader issues that don't get done, like talking about a broader issue with respect to transit and development and how we move forward as a city. Those tend to get bogged down within right. everybody's sort of own little area. Um, and so I think with a streamlined council, that will help. It will be useful. I, I've said this repeatedly. I, you can quibble with the process by which how Premier Ford and his government got there, but don't quibble with the results. And I think Torontonians will be very happy with it. Um, overall, we thought it was going to be a sleepy campaign. Uh, and then lo and behold, we, we now have the reduction. Uh, I think for my overall, uh, I know we're going to dive in a little bit future, uh, uh, more about uh, specifics. I think the mayor's race has been boring. Um, but as uh, Councillor Joe Mahavik aptly said when, uh, when the seats were reduced to 25, on the council side, it's going to be like Hunger Games. Hunger and Games, so that's a great line. that has <laughs> been the one um, uh, area with respect Incumbent to this race incumbent. that I certainly have been paying a lot of Absolutely. attention for our readers are very interested in um, obviously who they should support and, and, and what could be the composition of this, of this new council and what will, will happen in the next four years.